All right, this is a beholder brushless gimbal for GoPro from Team Rebel Designs. Uh, here we have the controller. Comes in a nice aluminum case. I have the dampener kit already assembled. I already had taken it apart to uh, already open the box to take pictures. Here we go. Dampener kit. It's nice carpet fibers. Little rubber pieces in the middle. Comes very nicely packaged, as you can see. Comes with <clears throat> all the pieces needed. Carbon fiber tube. We got two motors. All the aluminum pieces we need. Bag of screws. Comes with a little Allen wrench tool. Some of the top and bottom plates for the GoPro. Some more screws. Screw, screw. Push it down. Set that to the side. This is basically it. You got all the Get all the tools needed to put this together. Okay, so we'll start by uh, assembling the little cage for the GoPro. So we're going to be using the little small M2 they're like button heads you can see to assemble the cage so you can see this is a assembled GoPro cage comes together nicely Obviously, you're probably gonna have to take off the top plate to maybe add or remove it. Um, I'm probably gonna put some some dampener for the camera right here in the bottom. That's basically it. So that's that. Okay, let's assemble the, the frame. This is the back arm. And this is the side arm. Basically, he's gonna go like that. Yeah, <clears throat> these grooves seem to go for the art for the outside. As you can see, once you screw on, once you screw on the once you screw these screws on, they they stay flush to the surface. And the same thing here. If I put it from the other side, I don't think they'll be long enough. So yeah, they're for that. Let's get one of the motors out.
Motors seem very nice. Little cogging. Very little cogging. Shaft for the motor seems pretty thick. Nice little run for the wires. Very nice how the screws stay flushed. Has a nice little little cable run here. Kind of runs through here, runs through here, uh, like on the inside, and right up. So let's install the roll motor. I'll go ahead and tighten this, but obviously when you when you get everything set up, you're gonna have to balance. You're gonna have to balance everything, so you might have to slide this motor to the left or to the right in order to get the right balance. Basically you have the both motors mounted now. Simple. Gotta basically put those clamps on the tubes like that. Because the way this goes, it goes like this. Gonna have to adjust the tubes to match the hole. So all the 
you want to do is use these long screws there and there And they have these little lock nuts. Basically, once you got all that tightened up, you go ahead. Put your dampening paint on, and that's it. That's for for the top tube. And you go ahead and just mount this right here. basically end up with something like this That's basically it. Once you put the dampening systems on top, put that on top, put your GoPro balance, and it's tuning from there on out. <laughs>